Okay, this is the PA Preps All State Show. Uh, I'm at O'Brien today. We have uh, three star defensive. I'm oh, sorry, three star lineman Darian Bryant from Springside Chestnut Hill Academy. Did I get that right? Yes. Hey, thanks for uh, coming on today uh, to talk with us. Um, Darian currently has um, offers from. Uh, who, do you, who do you currently have offers from? I know you said UMass. And um, I have, my first one was Temple, and um. Recently, I just got one from U, uh, UMass. Okay. Now, who are some of the uh, other schools that you're uh, currently hearing from? Um, Ohio has been um, really recruiting me um, hard. They uh, actually want me to come down and um, meet them uh, and see the campus and things like that uh, before they offer me. Um, I've talked to UConn, uh, gosh, uh, Purdue. I've, I've talked to a little bit uh, mm -hmm. schools. Gosh, I'm trying to remember. And um, like Villanova in Delaware and uh, Bryant University have also contacted me. Okay, so you're getting both FBS and FCS. Yes, yes. Old, um, I'm going uh, to Old Dominion's Junior Day uh, next weekend. All right, now for those that don't know, Bryant stands at uh, 6'6", uh, 325 pounds, but he's a you know big and nimble guy. Um, what are some of the things that you know, you're hearing from these coaches as far as uh, what they like about you as a player? Or, or something um, they like about you. A lot of the coaches have told uh, talked to me. Um, they've told me things like, uh, for my size, I'm able to move pretty well. Um, I know Temple really likes that a, a lot about me. Uh, they like, you know, how um, how well I am in the past uh, in past blocking, and uh, you know, a lot of uh, a lot of coaches really like my size and uh, that I'm I'm athletic enough to uh, you know move with uh, being. Uh, so, so big. Now, what what side of the ball are they looking at you mostly on offensive or defensive, or have they even um, mentioned that a, yet? A lot of schools um, are looking at me at um, offensive line. So, um, a lot of uh, a lot of schools have talked to me about playing tackle. I know um, some schools have um, brought up maybe moving me to guard, but a lot of schools are uh, talking to me about playing offensive uh, offensive tackle. Okay, now you got the uh, two offers from UMass and Temple. Have you uh, taken any visits to any of those schools? Um, I've gone on um, two unofficial visits to Temple uh, just to see the facilities and meet the coaches. And um, I, I'm planning on going um, going there during the spring um, to uh, to visit to get uh, get a feel of the campus and see uh, see all the classes and things like that. Um, <clears throat> UMass, I'm going up uh, during my spring break, and uh, I was going to try to go down to Ohio just to meet the coaches and things like that. Okay. All right. Now, now I know you, see, you mentioned ODU. Do you have any um, other junior days planned within the next month or so? Uh, I will, in March, I'm going to uh, Villanova Junior Day. I uh, I'm going to the men's Junior Day. Uh, I was supposed to go to UMass's but it was on short notice, uh okay. so I wasn't able to get up there. And uh yeah, those are the only junior days. I know some schools uh have mentioned um me coming up for uh like camps and uh during the spring and things like that. Like um Pittsburgh and uh Yukon. Okay, now I've seen when you look at some of these well, let me backtrack. So many schools. Is there anything particular you're looking in for a school? I mean, obviously the football is a given, but is there any particular like subject you want to study in that may attract you to one school over another? Yeah, or you uh, I plan on um, majoring in uh, athletic training or kinesiology. So uh, that's one thing I'm really looking at uh, their programs and uh, athletic training and kinesiology. Um, I'm also, I mean, well, football-wise, I'm just looking for uh, the program, uh, how they develop their players, you know, um, uh, how, with, the, the, I guess, the scheme that the offensive line uh, runs and, uh, I guess, like the guys that, you know, um, who who graduates and the graduation rate also, you know, guys, you know, that have gone to the league. Uh, I've also really tried to uh, get to know the uh, offensive line coaches and just asking them you know, things I could work on, and, you know, how to get better cause, uh, and just build a relationship with the uh, coaches. So that's a lot what I'm really looking for in the school.
Okay, that's excellent. Um, obviously, it's still pretty early in the uh, recruiting process, um, and figuring you're going to get some more offers anyway. Uh, is there any t- particular timetable that you might have in mind as far as when you'll eventually make a decision, or is that something you'll think about, you know, further down the line? Um, at first, uh, my recruiting was going a little slow, so I had a timetable. I was going to uh, try to, uh, I guess, make a decision before the season, uh, my senior season. But now that it's picking up, uh, I think I might, you know, push it back because um, um, there's still schools uh, that have reached out to me, you know, just follow me on Twitter or uh, have a like, friend of me on Facebook and our the coaches and things like that. And uh haven't spoke spoken to me yet, but um I guess plan to speak to me. So uh I don't know, I'll just I guess I'll make my decision uh either in mid in the middle of the season or uh, maybe towards the end. And it depends on uh, how my recruiting goes. Uh we appreciate you uh taking the time to um talk with us today. And um we will we'll definitely be following your uh, process oh sorry, your progress. And like I said, I'm pretty sure you'll be getting some more offers. Uh, in the upcoming month. So definitely wish you the best of luck, and we'll definitely be speaking with you some more. Thank you. No problem. Have a good one. You too. Thanks.